I was planning on it being my last order, but if I get $12 more, I'd make 150 bucks. And so my greedy butt is feeling a little greedy. So. Hustling hyena clay. What is going on my hard working forever hustling gig economy drivers? It's Tony, your hustling hyena, and today is day number 15. Wow. Can't believe we got all the way to 15. I'm trying to save 12 to $15,000 for a Turo car. I am starting really late today, and for that, my goal is only gonna be 120 to $150. I'm hoping I can make that without no issues. And what helps is that first spark order of $37.74 going 9.1 miles. It's going pretty far, but it's not much I wouldn't do for anything above $35. Now, the reason why I'm starting late is because I had my oil change and I had all four tires replaced. So that took a little while and it actually cost me over $1,000 to do that. California, I tell you. Anywho. I am not going to put that against our profits for this Turo challenge. And the reason why is because I've been sparking, door dashing and Instacarting for the last six months. So I'm gonna take it from those profits. But from this profit, if anything else occurs, it'll go against it. Anyway, let's go run to the Walmart and let's get this massively profitable order. Just got the Walmart order loaded up and it took five minutes too long. It took 10 minutes to get to my car and there was no one else. So I don't know, maybe they're just kind of relaxing today, but I'm not relaxing. I'm on my way to the drop-offs. It's okay. It just started. Oh, good. Yeah. <laughs> How are you doing today? I'm doing good. Thank That's, you. Yeah. All right. Oh, How to take out the wagon, just in case. Yes. Come on in. <laughs> I love it. Thank you. No worries. Yeah. Usually I do everything in one kind of, you know, you know, I got to be all manly and stuff, trying to be yeah. all, all macho. <laughs> but yeah. All right, I love it. Do you want me to bring it inside? Just got that order dropped off. How sweet was she? And she also gave me a $5 tip. Some people are just so nice, just changes my whole day, you know? Some people can just make my whole day. Anyway, got a second drop off, so. And it's about 20 minutes away, so that's far. Traffic is probably starting. Let's get it. Order completed and I'm going back to my Walmart. I'm gonna start up my Instacart, my DoorDash and my Grubhub. I'm gonna see if I can get anything that's gonna take us closer to the Walmart. So after waiting at the Walmart parking lot for over 35 minutes, I ended up getting an order from DoorDash at Epic Wings, $10.25, 3.4 miles. And it's really close to the Walmart. So I hope I get something good from Spark as soon as I'm done with this order. All right, on my way to Epic Wings. Hey, what's up? I have an order for... DoorDash, Mike J, 
All right, thank you. Okay, cool. One eternity later. Hey, thank you. Have a good one. Just picked up the order from Epic Wings and DoorDash decided to give me an add-on. It's for $7. It's 4.9 extra miles I hooked on sushi. So I'm gonna get that done. And then I just got an order from Spark as well to pick up in about 25 minutes, $25.88. It's not my Walmart, but it's gonna take me closer to my Walmart because it's 12.8 miles away to drop offs. And hooked on sushi, here we come. Hey, I have a DoorDash order for Nicole B. Comes with alcohol, yeah, okay, that's cool. Heavy. Is it really heavy? Let's see, let's see. All right, thank you. Have a good one. Bye. Got both orders picked up and I find it funny how sometimes they just stare at the camera for a second. I'm not sure if you were able to see, but she was kind of staring at the camera. Anyway, I'm on my way to get these two dropped off and then flying to Walmart as fast as I can. Hello, I got some liquor. All right. hey. Yo, what is going on my Hustling Hyena clan? I got a quick announcement, need your support. This Saturday, January 28th, 2023, me and one of my favorite YouTubers, Nova Dasher, are gonna get on live stream so we can get to know each other, talk about the gig economy and suffer together as we take on the One Chip Challenge. As soon as I get more information, I'll make sure to post some details in my community tab. Please leave any questions or concerns, random thoughts, I'm all about them. I'll go ahead and make sure I shout you out. And finally, if you guys are enjoying my content, please consider liking and subscribing. And as always, leave a comment since I'm responding back to every single one of them. All right, back to the show. Just got to the Walmart after dropping off those two DoorDash orders. I swear DoorDash is so much more fun but Spark usually makes the most money, so I'm here waiting for my order to get loaded up. All right, how can I help? How can I help? I got the other one. All right, all right. Nice, thanks, bro. See you, man, have a good one. You got it? Thanks. Oh, hi. Would you like me to bring it here instead? Sure. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, of course. Got that order dropped off and another $5 tip, which is super awesome. Maybe Wednesdays are, maybe this Wednesday is a $5 tip day, which isn't bad at all. Ooh. Okay, I don't want to, I don't want this on the floor. It's getting late guys and you know, I only have a go of a hundred, I think to a hundred and thirty dollars. I don't really remember, but just got my next order. It's only for $9, it's Instacart. It's 1.2 miles or something. I'm gonna get that done ASAP. I have to get to the Walmart anyway because I have to run some errands. I have to go and print out a photo for Christmas. Anyway, yep, let's get it done. It's Instacart time.
the cart loaded up and I'm on my way to the drop off. I did it in half the time allotted to me, which was awesome, but I had alcohol. And when you have alcohol, you have to check out with an employee. And that took a lot longer than I wanted it to take. Good news though, is that I ended up getting a spark order for $21.80, going 7.1 miles. It's only one drop off, which is the reason why I took it. I was originally sent from Spark an order for $15.80 for five miles, two drop-offs. Let me know in the comments below if that was the order you would have taken or if you would have waited and just taken my order. I know it's scary sometimes to decline. I know sometimes I'm scared to decline only because I'm not sure I'll get another order. But once it gets dark, I know a lot of Spark drivers and point pickup drivers don't like to work anymore. So for me, this is prime time that I can be more choosy with the orders that I get. Oh, hi, I just need an ID. <laughs> there you go, thank you. <laughs> like that. Okay, let me make sure this all goes. Okay, perfect. Order dropped off. I don't even know if you guys can see me. Okay. Order dropped off. On my way back to the Walmart home base, DoorDash and Grubhub, I think are going crazy right now. So I'm going to see if I can just do some DoorDash and Grubhub to make some quick dollars before I get back onto Walmart Spark. All right, I'm taking one more Spark order for the night, $18.84. Not great, but it's one order, 2.7 miles. I think it's worth it especially since it's going to take me to an area that's pretty close to my house. Again, my DoorDash is open, so, and my Grubhub as well, so I'm ready to take anything else while this is getting ready. Just got the order picked up from Walmart Spark, and I'm on my way to the drop-off. It is like 10 to 12 sleeping bags alongside other things. I don't know if it's like a coat or I'm not sure why you need so many sleeping bags. And the reason why I say coat is because I was talking to the Walmart employee and they were telling me like, maybe it's a coat and they all need to sleep together. And now I'm a little terrified. Anyway, let's get it dropped off. And then I was planning on it being my last order, but if I get $12 more, because I remember the tip that it was $10, I'd make 150 bucks. And so my greedy butt is feeling a little greedy. So that's the plan. All right, sleeping bags, here we go. Done with that drop off, it was actually 10 sleeping bags and it didn't look like a cult. So I got excited for no reason. Anyway, I am in a very busy spot in DoorDash, but I have not received an order. I think DoorDash is playing games with me. Every time it's super busy, there's nothing. No orders. Give me an order. One. One that's $11, preferably. It's just a waiting game. Grubhub gives me more. Yeah. Oh. All right, well, time to get real close to the restaurants. Like I'm gonna be damn near in drive-throughs waiting. I waited a half an hour and I didn't get a single order. I swear I fall for this from DoorDash every single time. Very busy, busy in this location and nothing. I never get anything. I don't know if it's my acceptance rate. I know for other people I've seen on YouTube that their acceptance rate doesn't really matter. They're still getting orders, but this is insane. A half an hour, what a waste. I'm just in this parking lot trying to get an order, begging for an order. Yeah, I'm gonna head back my way. I'm gonna see if it's a little bit busier that route and uh, 
We'll see if we can make it 150. And I'm done. I waited another half an hour in my area to see if I can get a dash and I didn't. And so I wasted an hour waiting for a DoorDash order in two cities. Nothing came to me. And I mean nothing. Grubhub at least sent me some garbage that I declined, but DoorDash didn't send me a single order. Anyway, I'm done. Today is Wednesday, Hi, dudes. December 14th, 2022. From Spark, Instacart, DoorDash, and those two separate $5 tips, I made $140.83. I worked for six hours, drove 71 miles. Right now, gas is at $3.88. I drove 3.15 gallons of gas, and that comes out to $12.24. Now, if we subtract what I need to go ahead and give to Uncle Sam, then we're left with Thank you for watching. It really means a lot to me when you subscribe and when you comment. So please do. Again, it'll mean a lot to me. Thank you guys. I love you. Peace. God, I'm Kevin Hart. Whatever. What is going on with you? Oh. Hello, Waps. What's going on? Let's go. Why, wow, you brought me Bethany? Oh, thank you. Bethany the fish.